Well, hey guys, good morning, Brent Abel, webtennis.com, here with another episode of What's the Right Shot? Let me let me tee up the players for you. This is the world famous Berkeley Tennis Club, uh, kind of a chilly day. Uh, Guy Needham with the serve, yours truly, his partner, Cliff Felden on the receiving end here, uh, there, and then uh, his partner is uh, Brian Kaplan. And what I want to work on today is, um, you know, what you do as the server's partner on the on the second serve. And you know, first of all, put yourself, put yourself. This is you up here. You're the server's partner. Put yourself in the mindset of the receiver. The receiver's thinking most of the time. Okay, second serve. This player is never going to poach. And uh, and and if you sort of put yourself in that receiver's mind and show them an early invite that actually what you're going to do here is you're going to show them a fake poach. Is well, This is a little bit slow. Uh, anyway, let me go here. And you're going to show them a fake poach early, which makes this person think that, you know what, second serve, fake poach, this guy is just fake poaching. He's not going to go. And then what do you do? Bang, is you end up going. Let me kind of run this through again. <clears throat> so again, we've got we've got a first serve miss, and then you as the server's partner, you're thinking, that receiver over there, there's no way that you're gonna go, right? Fake, and then bang. So I want you to work on that fake poach. I want you to get out there, and I want you to look at what it really is. I mean, this is just a real a one step. It's just one quick step uh, out to the middle. And you can work a lot of things off of this. I mean, you could fake on this, right? This is number one, a fake where it could be visually distracting for this receiver. It could be enough to get sort of a an unforced, you know, forced error. You could stop there and you could come back. And they might think, you know what, maybe, maybe he's going to go. And they go up the line, and now you've come back, and you have a nice volley in the middle. Or in this case, let me take it back a hair, is you show this, come on, come on, man, all right, is you show the fake poetry, and and then you go. So right below the video, here's what I want to hear from you today. Tell me about your fake poach. Tell me about, do you ever use it? And number one, if you do use it, what's your strategy? I mean, are you just simply trying to create a visual distraction out there? Are you actually trying to time it so that the receiver thinks you're going and then they come back to you? Or are you also throwing in what you're seeing here, which is a, a, a an early fake and then and then a go? Right below the video in the comment section, let me know. And as always, come on, get out there today and make it another spectacular day. Thank mm -hmm. you.